yes people welcome to the channel today we've got a review of a boat it's a rewind inflatable dinghy so yeah let's get on with the video anyway as soon as I've got it inflated I'll show you the features and a bit more about it so this is the boat and this is how to inflate it you screw these in and then you screw this off you, you have a foot pump which comes with the boat so you pump one up to about say 70% then you pump two up then three up and then you pump it back up to uh, 100% so there's the boat flat and there's the foot pump that comes with it and that's reasonable quality. The actual boat thickness quality is very good. So we'll get it on the water, show you what it's like. There's a dog waiting for me. You're waiting to go waiting for me to go swimming, Luna. Yeah. She's just been literally lying down in the water. She literally gets out the minute I started the film. Oh, anyway, we'll probably see a lighter in the video anyway. Oh, she's going in. May as well keep the camera on it. Look, she'll just chill in there and wait for her. She's a brilliant dog. German Shepherds, best dog ever. Yeah, so this is the Rewind Dinghy, it's fully inflated. It's got a big front end. And this dinghy, it's always, this is seawater resistant. So for hitting the big waves or the rapids. You see, last time you had a dinghy, paid sweaty pound and it was one of the best way ones. This one costs, well it's on offer at the moment, at farm food's 30 quid, but you can put it in Google. Some people sell it, the uh, top price is like 80 quid, 50 and 70 quids and that. That's what it goes for, but it's on sale at farm foods. And yeah, the quality and the thickness compared to the 20 pound dinghy that I bought, the best way one, this is a lot better. It also comes with two paddles, which are like quick release. If you press that button, my hands are a bit sticky and it, do, it does separate. It also comes with a waterproof bag and Velcro straps, which is a good little feature so you can stick it on there. It blends in. You get some rope and some more rope and then your full waterproof bag to put your deflated dinghy in and there's your foot pump. I'd probably say max 500 pumps and the whole dinghy is inflated. Check that front end, it's huge. <laughs> Be good for hitting the waves. Well, it looks a good dinghy. It was a lot bigger and heavier than I thought it was. For 30 quid from farm foods, it's an absolute bargain. Right, here's the dog in the lake. And don't don't bite the boat. No bite in this boat. Because I'm on the other side. This is like the other side of the... I've just had to tie the boat up to the, the post. Drifting off. Uh, I've got some swan friends. Ah, oh, no, 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 oh, the dog just unclipped the boat, so I'm going to start drifting off again. I was just about to chill her for a bit. I've made kind of four loco. That's where I've come from, across the lake. The uh, swans are probably thinking, what's this guy doing here? One thing, watch out, Luna. Go have a rest. The boat stays nice and dry when you're in it. That's one thing I've noticed. I've been in other boats, you always get wet. This is literally bone dry. It's a few drops because I can't row and uh, the water goes everywhere. Well, there's our swanny friends. Hello, swans. So, yeah, this boat's pretty good. I like it. Well worth buying. You can tell it's pretty good quality as well. You can tell by the smell. You know, and the inflatable just got a really strong smell. I don't know if it's good or bad, but the stronger the smell, the better. Uh, oh, that's my opinion, anyway. Right, I think this is a... Uh, no, there'll be one more clip to show you. 
Yeah, so if you've got in a car, ignore this bit, so you should be alright at uh, transporting your boat. But this is how I do it. I got my little scooter, and depending on your scooter's range, some scooters have 50 mile range, some have 80 mile range, which that's is reasonably far. And I uh, can't remember what the, the, the boat weighs, but about 10, 50, ah, 10 kilograms. So I just, a couple of cable ties. Oh, oh, Jesus, look the thing on. As, as so, it's that heavy, I can't even lift it with one hand. That just shows how heavy the boat is, so it's got to be so quality. This is what I love about the boat, it comes in the water for his bag. So, yeah, just clip it onto your scooter and off you go. Off your butt, right to your lake. Now, that's it for now, guys.